Hello again, everyone, and welcome back to Revelations 2. We're, we're going to go ahead and pick up where we left off. Uh, and that is, we're, we're going to go ahead and finish episode 2. So now let's get to this real quick. It's probably going to play like a previously thing, but I'm going to skip it because it just plays the same thing from like... Uh, drop the, in, the entire oh. episode. Um, so last episode, we played as Claire... And we played like a, uh, like a Resident Evil 4 type. Was it, was it that episode? I'm not sure. It, I know we did that part. We, we do Claire's in like two episodes. Okay, now I remember. So the first part of Claire's episode. Well, I was trying to get to that tower when I was with her. Listen, honey, I need you to take me there. Can you do that? So the first episode of Claire's on my channel, of episode two. Moira, no, I don't believe it. There's no uh, way she's... Uh, we did like a Resident Evil 4 like standoff. Can I even go up here? No. Uh, we did like a Resident Evil 4 like uh, standoff in a house, and then we also in the, the next episode we uh, were basically so going toward, toward that tower. So. No, Moira was nice. <laughs> she does have a good heart. I bet she saw a little of Polly in you. That's her sister. Where'd you get that bracelet? I don't know. A woman used it to talk to us. I think. I'm not really sure anymore. A woman? The overseer? I read the debrief about her little experiment. Alright, to my friend, uh, friendlies uh, who find this. We've all been abducted against our will, unfortunately taken to the island. Our names are Neil Fisher, Pedro Fernandez, Edward Thompson, and Gabriel Chavez. I don't have any coordinates for our location, and I don't know if anyone else is here with us. There's something out there. I can't make, out, uh, make it out if it's human or animal. I can hear feral, vicious growling, at least multiple potential hostiles. We've been outfitted with these unusual devices on our wrists. We got a transmission from an unknown, unknown female telling us go to the Vosek. Not sure on the spelling. If you're a friendly who is reading this, meet us at the Vosek. Be safe and be alert. Chavez. Uh, is there anything here? Oh, okay, cool. Nice. I'll take that. Oh, I forgot I had a brick in my hand. <laughs> Silly me. Perry, look. Edward Thompson. He was with TerraSave. <sighs> Damn it, this is why I told her not to get involved. Very, very, very crazy stuff. We're kind of like going back and basically retracing ourselves with Barry's side of the campaign. Okay, now. There's some over there. Oh, God. Find some cover. I'll pick them off before they spot us. I thought it was I thought it was R1, <laughs> but it was R2. They had freaking last of us over here. I don't see anything else, so I'm assuming it's done. If not, I have ammo, so. 
I'll take that. I do want to say thank you guys for coming out and watching. It really means a lot. It keeps me uh, doing more content like this. Resident Evil or Overwatch, whatever it may be, just keep uploading on the channel. Um, hopefully, by the end of this year, 2022, I'll have my PC up and running. My new PC. And I won't sound like this. I'll probably get a new microphone for... Alright, there's multiple of them here. More over there. How did you see me? I was literally clearly behind the wall. You saw that, right? Literally. literally. Sometimes I feel like the AI in this game, whether they be friendly or not, I feel like it's just there to like, to really get you and be kind of annoying. So, is there anything for me to get in here? I don't think so. There's not a way to get in, so we're gonna go ahead and push forward. Damn it! I need a key. All right. I guess we do need something here. I didn't see this hill up here, so. This place is crawling with them. Be careful. A smoke screen robs an enemy of their sight, allowing you to run away and hit them with a stealth attack. Okay, got to know. I was like literally clearly outside, but Okay, she didn't pick that up, but Alright, let's see if I can get this guy to like turn around and then just gonna go up to him and melee him. Save ammo. <laughs> I literally thought that was too late, honestly. Surprised it doesn't see the girl, but you know. But it hasn't seen us. Uh no shit, Natalie. Natalia, Natalie, whatever your name is. I'll get her right, you know. Any more zombies? Yeah, there's one over there. Or infected, rather. <laughs> Ruby, we need more of those. Looks like I can get this and put it somewhere, actually. Oh, shit. It's probably gonna turn around, watch. Psych. I was I was re literally like ready for it to like turn around and get me. Okay, it looks like there's nothing there anymore. Whoops. So we're gonna use this to climb up top of here because I'm assuming that's where we need to go. Surprise this little kid can make it. There's another one of those emblems, but I don't care. Ooh, hunting rifle. Look at that. Definitely need that. And this should get us through. There's the gate key. There we go. Nice.
We'll take that, and I believe that's everything in here. Is there anything I can point to and grab? Doesn't look like it. So let's go back up. Maybe. But yeah, I'm so excited to get this new PC in mine. Um, I'm saving up money right now for it, working extremely hard, and uh, we're getting we're getting on a roll here. So. See if I can change the slots of my guns, but I think I need a, to go to a workbench for that. Oh, and then we're gonna go back where we came from. There we are. Is that where you met Moira? Over there? Yeah, near the big tower. Let's go ahead and continue forward. Monster! The fuck? Where? Something over there. That was strange. Right there. Don't you see it? I don't know what you're talking about, kid. Honestly, kind of terrifying. Oh, that's not good. I didn't know it was too late for that. Oh, God. All right, cool. At least they gave me an herb. <laughs> oh, that scared me. I had nowhere to go, bro. Whoa, it's loading. Why did it load? Vision's getting kind Barry, there's something right there. I don't know what you're seeing, but point me at it. There, shoot! You hit it! Keep going! No, more right! What is that? Invisible monsters. Oh, that's gonna be fun. Yeah. It seems like Resident Evil tends to have I like how she didn't even call out and I just guessed where it was. I couldn't even see him either. Like she just didn't say anything at all. Somebody really trashed this place. What the hell happened? The bracelet. What I've learned so far, there's a GPS tracker inside, probably for keeping tabs on where we are. It's a two-way transmitter. We can hear her, and she can hear us. The source of the transmission is coming from the center of the island, someplace high up. It's got to be that funky-looking tower. I have no doubt she's there, too. It also seems to be keeping tra uh, track of our vital signs. For what purpose? She wasn't kidding when she said she had infected us with a virus. Holy balls. What are we supposed to do? Uh, just not die, idiot. All right, we're gonna give a recoil to the assault rifle because you know I'm actually gonna switch. We're gonna switch this stuff around. So we want the gun to the left. We want the sniper up top. The magnum can be uh, the bottom since it's the most powerful, and then we can have the assault rifle. I usually have that in RE games. 
because uh, it's just my standard like lo uh, loadout. Oh, neat. We need that. Okay, she doesn't have a brick anymore, so. That. Uh, yeah, this is the house that we were protecting. Uh, we were basically like at our wits' end here. Like, I, she's not even saying anything. I'm literally just taking a, a guess at this point. I don't know if that's a bug or what, but it's kind of annoying. Okay, this is where the helicopter was at, I believe. I came this way once. Or, no. Moira might have been here too. Yeah, let's not. Because I really don't want to deal with that. Can you imagine how loud this would be in the ground, this gun? Or any kind of gun, really? I don't see anything sparkly. Here comes the rain. Are you gonna be warm enough? I'll be all right. So where are your mom and dad? They died. In Terra Grandia. You were there when the city went down? I'm sorry. None of this could have been easy. You're a tough girl. Thanks. It's on people like me to protect people like you from bioterrorists. We shouldn't have let you down. So, where'd you go? Terra Safe put me in a home. A facility. I'm sorry, Natalia. I won't ask any more questions. Honestly, kind of messed up that she lost her mom and dad. Who's that? What's wrong? Oh, I've been waiting for you. Nothing. Can we go? Someone spying on us. I'm assuming this is where we need to go and we don't have anywhere else to go, so yeah, it looks like it. So let's go this way. Kinda sucks that the enemies don't drop any ammo or anything, so They're inside. Be careful. Oh, I hear them. I don't know if I need to go up or down, honestly. Maybe down is the way to go, but let's go ahead and check upstairs, though. Oh, well, looks like we need a drill, so never mind. Yeah. 
bullshit, you saw me. There's something ahead. Be careful. Gotta save the ammo. I was just gonna check and see if I see any like ammo or something. See? Boom, done. Magnum ammo. We need that. Most definitely. So Oh, I missed that. Please don't come this way. What is that? I don't even want to know. I'm assuming it's dead because the music stopped. I don't even want to know what the hell that was. That was a big boy, honestly. the ammo that I have, but it looks like I have no choice, mainly because <laughs> you expect me to like, you honestly expect me to sneak around this place? I was just a guess, honestly. Expansion bag in Italia, that means I can carry more stuff. Awesome. Let me check through everything here, because... Is there any crates? Anything on top of here? Doesn't look like it. Onwards. these monsters can't really tell um, I'm not seeing anything sparkly so I'm gonna go ahead and go forward I see an herb though uh, Natalie you, you can you can take it Barry has three, so. Please don't turn around. Oh, God. That looks like it's gonna shoot a projectile or something at me. Yeah, like that. Kinda missed the second shot, but... Oh! <laughs> Goodbye, physics. <laughs> What's so nice seeing ya?
Where is it? That's behind me. There's one behind me. It's getting closer. There's like one behind me. It's getting closer. No, more right. Not there, more left. Alright, you know. Okay, you're god awful. Just gonna say it. Honestly, hate her. I hate her programming, and I hate this idea of uh, something. So let me see. Can I craft something? So there's a there's something nearby. I hear it. I'm tired of it. We're just gonna annihilate you like that and just be done with it. Because this girl cannot tell me exactly where it's at. Alright, the latest uh, mock moved us even closer to the re uh, real test. This time, 11 cadets were fitted into the sensor bracelets and then subjected to extreme emotional stress for their any length of time. Three died immediately. I think I read this before, so we're gonna go ahead and just like skip it. Um. Again, we are retracing our steps, so. Okay. Um. Sweet. Gunpowder. Give that to him. Okay, let's go ahead and go forward because, man, these invisible enemies are really annoying. Uh, doesn't seem like anything in here. Let's go forward. Shouldn't go on ahead. Okay, but what's she doing? Pointed at. Literally no ammo at all. Um, so that's lovely. And I got ass blasted right there. You didn't see anything, you didn't see that. You lost. 
false. No, you're false. You're ugly. Stinky. I thought I just healed. <laughs> Why so glowing red? Um. All right, we'll take that off. We'll put damage two on this, and then we'll just uh, do damage one on the rifle. How about that? This is where I met Moira. Good. Let's pick up the pace. It's dead. I'll have to find another way. Okay, looks like we need a drill or something, because... Alright, things have changed so much since she came here. Our... I don't even know how to pronounce that. It's almost like a completely different island now. There's new equipment in the mines and the jobs, not just laborers, but she's employing people as researchers as well. There are so many employment opportunities. I cannot express my gratitude to her deeply enough. Despite this, there's those who doubt her. She uh, such ingrates. If you don't like it, you're always free to leave this place. I mean, I don't want to leave too, honestly. Who's there? Keep it down. Okay, well. I hate those bugs, honestly. I despise them. They're stinky. There has to be like some something to point at in here. Aha. Okay, let's see. Your father hasn't come uh, home at all since going to the monument. I tried to wait, but I can't do it any longer. I've gone off to look for him. I was feeling uh, pretty anxious, but every one there was so nice to me. They told me something nasty was going around, so they gave me a, pre a preventative shot and this bracelet that uh, they said that would help protect me. This place is so large and wondrous. I've never seen anything like it. Of course, this is probably no big deal for her. She saved our island. I'm starting to feel like she can do anything. I regret ever have, uh, having doubted her. I suppose it's nothing, but I've been feeling a bit dizzy. Maybe I'm a, just stressed. Oh, and I finally found your father. Well, part of him anyway. I always knew he had a good head on his shoulders. Now that's all that's left of him. I can't possibly bring him back like this. This bracelet has been making strange sounds. It's a little annoying. But don't worry. I'm going to find the rest of your father and we're going uh we're coming home. You must be so hungry. Okay. What are you say? Anything in here to point out? Uh, we'll do that.
I hate the bugs. Stop it with the bugs. Disgusting asses. I hate them. Harry, there's something over there. Well, it can wait because I'm doing something. Walk from the other side. Okay. Anything to point at? The brick. Okay. Wait. <laughs> well, that's one hell of a parking job. Damn, Barry, you can lift that whole fucking helicopter. <laughs> Jesus. Interesting. Wait, can I go through here? Oh, I got through here. Empty bottle. And then I'll combine this. I want to have at least like one explosive on me, but that's just me now. Uh. No, I didn't want to use it. Oh my. What the fuck? Oh, that didn't count. All right. See, I'm out of ammo, honestly. Actually... I killed him with the knife! <laughs> On accident, I was trying to get to this fucking... I was trying to get to this box, and I just ended up freaking... <laughs> oh my god, what luck, bro. That's so funny. a whole lot more options. Oh my god, I can't believe it. That's so funny. Get shit on, I guess? See that? <laughs> That's what she gets. Alright, so now we need to go back. Right. 
Let's go ahead and continue forward. Me and Moira got separated here. The nice guy came and got me. Nice guy? The one from Terra State who rescued me. I wonder if Moira made it to the tower. She made it. Come on, let's see what we can find. Honestly, I should have got a trophy for killing that guy with the knife. This place has changed. Yeah. Pretty creepy, huh? Oh. Natalia. Kill, crush. That's always lovely. We're fighting another boss? What's going on? Nice. Alright, let's see what this... Let's read this real quick. Alright, trials for the T-Phobos virus are almost complete. We managed to reduce the lethality of the T-Virus, which, while creating the condition that it triggers upon the target being subjected to strong emotional trauma, we also lowered the rate of viral resistance to below 2%. All is proceeding as planned. However, the time draws near. We are almost to perfection. There is zero margin for error. Well, that's where we came from, right? Is this where we came from? Yeah, this is where we came from. lore real quick uh, you poor decrepit old man you wanted to create a new world and rule over that world as a god but all but for all your ambitions you couldn't overcome man's most formative uh, formidable uh, enemies age and disease you had everything but your crumbling body betrayed you and then your own son snuffed out whatever pitiful entrails of life you had left leaving you to become nothing more than a footnote in the annals of history you failed old man. But fear not, your dream will live on. I will take the wealth of knowledge, power, and test subjects you have given me, and succeed where you failed. I will create the new world, and I will rule over it as a god. Your legacy will have long, uh, will have been long forgotten, but mine has only just begun. May your soul, if you ever had one, rot in torment for all eternity, and let hell be filled with the sound of your teeth gnashing incessantly. Literally, um, she, she, this overseer guy, oh god, is um, talking about Oswald E. Spencer, which you know he got killed in Resident Evil Five. Spoilers, I know, but um. He got killed by what? He got killed by Wesker. So, uh, Albert Wesker, be exact. Scary. I can't stand her. Who? The woman here with Wesker? That is Wesker. Alex Wesker. 
Two Weskers? You gotta be shitting me. <laughs> so you finally came. Okay, so that might be the overseer that we're talking about that we've been seeing like throughout this like well we haven't seen her but or it or you know him whatever you, you never know. Next time on Revelations two. Is Alex Wesker the overseer? Question mark. Wait, this is more. Is it somebody else? No, no sign of her. Uh, of course, this factory had to be a fucked up factory. She's responsible for the experiment six months ago. It's got all our names on it. I'll crush you. Where did we go wrong? Where's Moira? <laughs> that doesn't sound like her. That doesn't sound like the girl talking on the bracelets. Unless, you know, the infection kind of just, like, got to her and made her, like, voice change, obviously. Um, but the next episode's called Judgment, so that's going to be, uh pretty pretty interesting already but that was episode two that was episode two so uh we got an a nice and we unlocked some stuff which i don't care about um completed this in 40 minutes not that bad really um or at least this part um we're gonna go ahead and spend some skills real quick so we'll do that uh hold down r2 to charge a physical Okay. Uh, we're definitely gonna put that because it seems like I run out of ammo a lot. Um, so we're gonna do that definitely. And we're gonna increase herbs, so that's what we're gonna do. But uh, thank you guys so much for coming out and watching this episode. This episode might be longer than normal. I might divide it up. We'll see how it goes. But um, most definitely, I shall catch you in episode three of Judgment of Revelations 2. Thank you guys, and I'll see you next time.